You are bold. You are brilliant and you are beautiful. There is no other woman like you because you are your own kind of woman. These are the affirmations that I give myself every morning to remind myself of who I am, to remind myself of what I've overcome, to remind myself of my worth. At 13, I was signed with a major modeling agency and I was traveling the world shooting amazing campaigns. At 17, I graduated high school. Back home in Nebraska, I was already labeled the fat model, the girl who was pretty for a big girl. My body, like my confidence, has been picked apart, manipulated, and controlled by others who didn't necessarily understand it. I struggled to achieve true confidence. And when I would go home, I would be disgusted with the woman that I saw in the mirror. I was incapable of affirming myself. I actually had an agent tell me, wave money in my face and tell me, if you lose some more weight, you can make a lot more of this. Oh, and P.S., you're never going to be in a magazine. My insecurities had to be faced head on because I, like so many young women, struggled to love the woman I saw inside the mirror because of society's narrow vision of beauty. I needed to reclaim my body and its image as my own. I became my own role model. No one else was to have that job. Over the last 15 years, I've come to the conclusion that there is no one perfect body. I felt freed once I realized I was never going to fit a narrow mold that society wanted me to fit into. I honestly love my cellulite, my rolls, the inner part of my thighs that jiggle and touch. It's gorgeous. We need to start looking beyond the exterior of a woman. And we need to start looking at her for what she's doing, who she is. Create a safe space for the important women in your lives. For women to be who they are, not hide themselves because of what they're not. Never let anybody tell you no. Never let anybody tell you you can't. Be you. Be real. Be authentic. Be your favorite kind of woman. Don't let anybody else take that job.